Hello everyone. In order to understand the ladder diagram for OR gate, we need to first know how does an OR gate operate. This is the logical symbol of two input OR gate where Y is given as A plus B. Let us consider a typical example in order to understand this where we have two switches connected in parallel to a light load in this particular fashion. Since A and B is open circuited, it corresponds to a state of zero and the light does not glow because both are open circuited. The truth table corresponding to it is given as when A and B is equal to zero, the output will be equal to zero because both are open circuited. Now let us consider one of the switches being closed that is it corresponds to a state 1 and the switch that is open corresponds to a state 0. And in this case current starts flowing through the load and as a result light close because of the switch B. So the truth table corresponding to it is 0 1 corresponds to a state of 1. Now when A is closed and B is open the current will still flow through the load and consequently the light load glows because of the switch A because it acts as short circuit. So the truth table corresponding to it is 1 0 corresponds to a state of 1. Now if both the inputs A and B is actually short circuited then obviously current will flow through both the paths and the light actually close. So when A and B is equal to 1 the output will be equal to 1. So this is how we need to understand how does an OR gate operate. The ladder diagram can be analyzed just like the way we did it for the switches. Let us consider two contacts connected in parallel to the load in this particular fashion. So we are using a lighting load again. So these type of contacts are actually called as normally open contact. That is only when the push button is pressed consequently the coil will be energized and acts as short circuit and the light load will glow. So let us consider the first case where I am not pressing both the push buttons and the output will be equal to zero in this particular fashion. Second case when I am actually pressing the switch B consequently the push button switch is closed and the coil B is energized in this particular case and current starts flowing through the load and the light close in this particular fashion. Case 3 when I am actually pressing push button switch A consequently the coil is actually energized and current starts flowing through the load in this particular fashion. Case 4 when I energize both of them by pressing both the push button switches consequently both coil A and B is actually energized and current starts flowing through the load and the light close. So this is how we will be analyzing a ladder diagram and this is the ladder diagram for OR gate. I hope this concept is clear. In case you like this video please do like it and share it and subscribe to our channel for regular updates. And thanks for watching this video. Meet you guys in another video. Keep supporting.